Assalamu alaikum everyone, my name is Abdurrahman Turkman from Afghanistan. In today's video, I am going to show you 7 ways to fix laptop battery not charging problem. With these 7 methods, you can fix almost any kind of problem that you are facing with your laptop's battery. So please watch this video till the very end as I will be explaining everything step by step. And if you find this video helpful by any means, then please share it with your friends. Come on guys, sharing is always free, it doesn't cost you anything. So with that being said, let's get started. As you can see here I have a laptop with similar problem. The problem with this laptop is it doesn't take charge. Even the charger is plugged in. So as you can see here it says 0% not charging. Even the charger is plugged in. And this is what happens when I unplug the charger. As you can see it turns off right away. So the first method is draining the power from your laptop. To do that unplug your charger. Take out the battery. Next, next, press and hold power button for about 10 to 15 seconds. What it will do is, it will drain all the remaining power from your laptop. And hopefully, it will fix the problem. Okay, once you've done that, now put the battery back on and start your computer. Okay, now let's see whether the problem is fixed or not. Nope, my problem is still there. First of all, try this method. If it worked, it's good. If it didn't, then you don't have to worry. Just skip to next ones. The next method is removing or updating the battery driver from your laptop. This method will also work with those laptops that doesn't have removable batteries. I mean, laptops with not removable batteries. So first of all, turn off your laptop, next, take out the battery, and start your computer without the battery. In order to remove or update your battery driver, first of all, click on start and type device manager and open device manager after that select batteries and expand the list now you need to uninstall or update these two drivers from your laptop right click on it and if you want to update it just click on update and select the first option it will search for the latest update available for your laptop's battery. If you want to uninstall it, just right click on it and click on uninstall. And also uninstall the second one. Next, put the battery back on. and start your computer in most cases this method will work if it didn't work for you then you don't have to worry just skip to next ones our next method is resetting your windows to do that first of all turn off your computer once it's completely turned off turn it back on and press escape button from keyboard in your case Key combination might be different. All you need to do is get into system recovery. So in my case here it says press F11 to get into system recovery. So I'm just going to press F11 and it's going to take me to my computer's system recovery. From there I can reset my windows. Okay once you see this page all you need to do is select troubleshoot from here. Next select the first option. Now it will give you two options. If you select the first option, it will remove all the apps and softwares and settings from your keyboard. But 
It will keep your personal files like your documents, pictures, videos, audio and all the other things. And if you select the second option, it will remove everything from your computer. So I'm not gonna do either one of these because I'm, I'm not gonna lose all my settings and apps. You can perform this method at your own risk. So this option is there for you. Our next method is using wall sockets directly instead of using one of these extendable sockets. The possibilities are there might be some fault in your extendable socket and it's not passing the current that is required to charge your laptop's battery. So try to charge your laptop directly from your wall socket and see if the problem is solved or not. Okay, our fifth method is resetting your computer BIOS to its default settings. To do that, first of all, turn off your computer. After that, turn it back on, then press escape key continuously. If your laptop is other than HP, then go to Google and search for your laptop model and reset BIOS settings and you will find information from there. So in my case, I am using HP, for me escape key works. Ok, if you are using HP laptop, just follow my instructions. So now here it says press F10 to get into BIOS setup, so I am gonna press F10. Ok, once you are in the screen, all you need to do is press F9 from your keyboard. After that, it's gonna ask you whether you want to load default setups. So just select yes using your arrow keys and after that hit enter. Once you've done that, press F10 and hit enter. That's all you need to do. After doing this, your problem should be fixed. So let's see my problem is fixed or not. No, nope, my problem is still there. Our sixth method is repairing corrupted windows files. To do that, first of all, click on start and type cmd and right click on cmd and run it as administrator. Once the CMD page is opened, type here SFC slash scan now. Make sure there are no space between scan and now. Type it without the space. After that hit enter. What it will do is, it will repair all the system files that are causing laptop battery no charging problem. So this process will take time so you have to be patient. There is another way to repair corrupted system files and that is by using a utility software like CCleaner. So just go to Google and search for CCleaner and download and install CCleaner in your computer. So I'm just gonna go ahead download the free version of the software. Ok, after that click on cleaner and make sure these are all checked, after that click on run cleaner. Ok, now you can see it's removed all the junk files from my computer. You should also clean your registry, so just click on registry and click on scan for issues. And it will scan all the problems that your computer has. So. This is gonna take time. Okay, now you can see these are the problems that are exist in my computer. So now just click on fixed selected issues. So it's asking me to back up these data. So I'm just gonna save the backup on my desktop. Okay, now it's done. Now once you've done that, restart your computer and see if your problem is fixed or not. If the method shown in the video didn't work for you then you should consider replacing your laptop's battery or the charger. There might be some fault in one of these so try to replace it and see if your problem is solved or not. So there you have it guys that was my 7 methods to fix laptop battery no charging problem. Please let me know which one of these methods work for you. Let me know in the comment section below and if you enjoyed this video then please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to share it with your friends. 
And if you want more videos like this, then please subscribe to my channel with notification on. And I'll catch you on the next one. Have a wonderful day.